We have got new leaks for the upcoming Gorilla Tag update. We have possible leaks for a revamp, a new map, a possible flashback, and much more. So you're going to want to watch to the end because it is crazy. Now like and subscribe or this crab will pinch your face too. I must have forgot to like and subscribe. Okay, so this next update is about to be huge. So starting off pretty simply, we are pretty much due for a flashback. In about a week from now, so next Friday, we are supposedly supposed to get a back to school flashback because it's almost school time, unfortunately. Let me know when you guys go back to school. Some people already have. I go back in a couple weeks. But we are going to be getting a back to school flashback within like the next week. So that is what the flashback will be. That one's pretty much guaranteed. The update happened around the same time last year. Or was it a flashback? Either way, we had a flashback or the update last year. I don't really remember. We're going to be getting it again. Now, moving on. As you guys may know, they shut down or closed the attic. The recent update, obviously. They shut down the attic for whatever reason. You obviously just can't get in there. Please let me in. I don't know if you could see it. I'll try to show it through, I guess, this crack. You can't really see it. But there's a sign in there. And that sign says, the monkeys have put away the Legos for now. And that's in like parentheses. But what this means is obviously that's going to be opening up again. And there should be Legos. I mean, that's what the for now seems to foreshadow to me. So we're going to have some sort of new map in there, I guess. I don't know if they're going to change it a bunch or if they only got rid of it to fix some stuff. But all I know is when they add back the Legos, it's going to be crazy. The Legos were a lot of fun. Building maps was a lot of fun. So I can't wait for them to come back. And I imagine in the next update, they will be bringing it back because they really have no reason to keep it out for more than like an update. The main reason I think they took it out is because of all the glitches that had to do with this. Like there's platforms and I just think they didn't want that to get out into like the regular map where people could just cheat without even modding. So that should be coming back very soon, supposedly within the next update, but you never know. But it should be next update that that will return. And before we get to the next leak, uh, just like and subscribe again. I can never say it enough. Please like, please. As I said in my last leak video, we are pretty much due for a new rotating map. Oh. It's been a about like over a month. It's a little over a month since the last update when they added. So about two months ago, they added the OG caves back with Lucy. And about a month ago, I believe they added the little Dr. Evil or whatever his name is area over here where you need the key card and you could get in there. And a little while ago in one of TTT Pig's video, he said that this is going to be getting an update supposedly soon. Obviously, an update has passed since he said that, so it should technically be next update. This next update just looks like it's going to be huge. Like, we could get back the attic map, a possible revamp, and then obviously this little evil horror game mode, whatever it is. So that's just going to be a crazy update. Let me know if you guys are excited for that. I personally can't wait. I, I've always kind of wanted there to be a horror game mode in Gorilla Tag. It's my favorite part of like Gorilla Tag fan games. So to have it in regular Gorilla Tag would just be really cool. We know it's possible because of all the Gorilla Tag horror like fan game games. It'd be cool. But now we're gonna get on to the biggest part on um, what looks like is coming, possible revamp. So before we get to it, comment your guesses on what map you think it's gonna be below before I show you guys. Cause honestly, I think it's a little late for them to do a revamp. I feel like they should have did it more in the summer and you'll see why in a second. But let me go first person. And obviously you can now see where we're going. We're going straight to mountains because we are going to be getting a mountain revamp. I've actually never seen it snowing. But as you can see, if we make our way over here, for some reason, the snow around the trees has melted. I don't know how many updates this has been like this for, but I imagine the snow is going to completely melt and we're going to get some sort of revamp. Whether the snow's coming back or not, obviously the snow here is melting. So we're going to be having to get some sort of revamp. The lighting in this place is really weird. I don't know if this is a PC only thing, but why is the like, look at this. This just doesn't look right. Why is the lighting so weird in here? Off point. Like and subscribe if you guys are excited. I, I can't wait to see what they do with this because I don't think we've gotten a mountains revamp in a while. So it would just be really cool to see what they do with it. Otherwise, if we're not getting a revamp, I literally have no other idea on why they would add this. The snow is melting away. It's got to have something to do with a revamp that's literally my best guess and i feel like there's no way they could do anything else with it so i'm super excited it's been a super long time since they've revamped mountains i don't even know if they've ever revamped it that drastically but hopefully they just do something super cool with it so uh, like i said a mountains revamp would be sick um i'm like very confident that's got to be what's happening next 
but since it's so close to the summer ending it feels like such an odd time for them to do a revamp um i'm pretty sure they're going to be getting rid of metro soon for some reason it's i could have sworn i saw something about this so um unless i'm wrong I don't know if you guys know what I'm talking about. I could have sworn before this update came out, this was supposed to be the last update with Metro and we were supposed to say goodbye, but obviously Metro is still here. So maybe this is the last update with Metro. I really don't know what's good with it. I could have sworn they were saying something about taking it away. But if they do take it away, it would be super cool to see them do something else with Metro because at least from my experience, recently Metro has been pretty dead. Like it's nobody's in it after it became an update. So if they would just add to Metro or change it. That would be super cool. So I'm assuming they're gonna be doing that, um, but I could be wrong. I, I just could have sworn I've seen something about it. But yeah, they're definitely gonna be doing a flashback. As you can see, they already have the thing set up in here. I don't know if they're here all the time, to be honest, I don't really check, but <clears throat> they're definitely just going to be doing that school's back flashback, which I mean, it's kind of sad. Like it's cool that we're gonna be getting a flashback, but I don't wanna be thinking about school because it feels like summer just started. Summer went by so fast. I don't know if you guys agree, but Summer went by so fast this year. But yeah, as you can see, they've opened up here. Like I said, I don't know if it's always open, but I mean, this pretty much just guarantees we're getting a flashback. Um, I don't know if they're gonna add stuff up here. They normally do, but I don't think the summer flashback was really that big. But um, what do I know? I, I didn't really play during that, to be honest. I was playing like fan games during that time. So I don't even think I hopped on for that update, but that update will be super cool. I can't wait to see that. I can't wait to see what they're gonna do with cave because they've added the water but there's no way that's gonna last for more than like a month even they're probably gonna take it out before the end of summer so i'm curious on what they're gonna do with that if they're just gonna set it back to normal or what they're gonna do with mark i'm gonna miss mark mark was a goat but sometimes you gotta lose your friends like doug had to lose his girlfriend in the valentine's update oh i'm curious on what they're gonna do with this i guess we'll find out it'll probably be next update i have a good feeling that the next update is just gonna be ginormous because there's so much stuff that they're hyping up so i just can't wait to see what they do with the next update okay so i hope you guys enjoyed like and subscribe and i'm out just real quick shout out to these members on screen i'm gonna try to find them and link them in the description so you guys could subscribe to them because i still don't really know what i'm gonna do with this feature it's kind of just there i don't have enough to do like live streams or anything like that by the way i know i'm like bringing this up like bringing up the membership thing but like don't feel the need to become one obviously um but links in the description go sub to these people goats absolute goats still trying to figure out what to do with this so kind of my bad for uh i guess having it i don't really know what to do with it at the moment i guess i'll just show you guys out in the meantime while i try to think of stuff but um yeah that that's pretty much all i wanted to do at the end of the video i hope you guys enjoyed um let me know if you guys are excited for this new update i personally am um the flashback should be cool but at the same time yet again a sad flashback anyways i hope you guys enjoyed the video i'll see you guys in the next one in peace victor on the beat <sighs>